It is a real exodus. Thousands of Muslims leaving the capital, Bangui. They are forced into exile to survive. Their destination, Chad. The northern neighbor, who has long interfered here in the Central African Republic, has sent soldiers to escort these people. Many of them have family roots in Chad, but have never been. The Christians say the Muslims must go back where they came from. That's why we are going home. We had no option to stay here, because we had no protection. They don't want to miss this convoy. It's just too dangerous. A man fell off one of these lorries. He was reportedly lynched and chopped into pieces. Even the road to the border isn't safe. Seeing them leave their homes isn't enough for these angry mobs of Christians they want to kill. I don't think there can be reconciliation, maybe with others, but not with Muslims. Similar scenes are happening throughout the country. Tens of thousands of Muslims have already left, forced by this. Their neighborhoods have been emptied, houses and mosques ransacked and burned down. Revenge and reprisal attacks are forcing a minority Muslim population out of the Central African Republic. In this conflict, the Christians haven't been spared either. But how will this country stand together again? Thomas Fessy, BBC News.